All right, guys, you see, we got running water out here coming off a nice little creek. This heads down towards the Congaree River out this way. I think maybe if I get down there a little further, I have some land open up, try to fish this creek back towards the river. I'm breathing heavy. You're gonna make the move. See if we can't get set up. All right, old Machete done his job. Cleared us out a good spot. Getting ready to show you what I'm working with. Stop breathing. <laughs> like an extreme fat boy. All right, y'all. Get back with you in just a second. That's a pretty good pull. It's moving good like it's like it's not a turtle. We got something. <coughs> what do we got? What do we got? Small catfish, small channel, y'all. He's a little too small to keep. Piece of fresh cut chicken from Publix off a chicken leg. I didn't take no time at all. We catch one big enough, we gonna keep him. He wasn't quite big enough. All right guys, we are about to pack it up, move to a different spot. Cause this one just ain't cutting it. That was a tough track in just for one little catfish. But that's just how it goes. I feel like we can just get through this portion, y'all. We'd be in a lot better shape. We've got way too much gear with us. Way too much gear. All right, y'all, piece of fresh bluegill. Get rid of the tail. Cut me a chunk of the body right here. I'm gonna hook him through this bottom side. So I'm just gonna remove that bottom fin so I can't hook back through it. Simple rig, number two circle hook. Through the body, remove the scale. We're gonna put it over there in that corner. We are hooked up. Tighten my drag a little more. Didn't take long. That's a nice fish. This is a nice fish. Get the net. I got 30 pound leader, 20 pound braid. Y'all, I do not know what this is. Keep tension on him. It's a nice fish. I 
I don't want him getting in my bait line right there. Yes, sir. This is a nice catfish. All right. Hope like hell nothing grabs that. It's a nice fish. He's a fighter too, boy. It's another flathead. It's another flathead. Flathead in the net, though. Flathead in the net. Whew. That was a good move. Piece of cut bluegill. Small body piece. Fresh. Gentleman David that was here, or Dave, that was here prior to me showing up to this spot, gave me the bluegill when he was leaving. So I told him I was going to try to catch a fresh one. He gave me one he just caught. Look at that. Nice flathead. Right in the side of the mouth. Circle hook worked just like it's supposed to. All right, guys. I'm going to stick him back in the net. Get my other pole situated. I think he's going to be, uh, he's going to be dinner. All right, we're going to try a piece of chicken, chicken leg. I don't know what happened. Oh! Ah, that hurt. That hurt pretty good. Oh, man. Ah, right on the old spine. Jiminy Christmas. Hmm. All right, piece of chicken. crap we are hooked up we are instantly hooked up on this one make sure i'm recording and i am uh, it's another decent fish y'all another decent fish nothing monstrous no 20 pounder he's nice he's not net worthy Oh, that was instant, instant hookup. 
he's better than the last one he's five five or six pounds i bet all right man it's a good move over here y'all i hope that camera's recording i've been having tons of trouble with it All right, he's not a meat one. He got to go free. That's just fishing too wore out, guys. I'm just tired. I'm sorry. We got a pickup. We are recording. There we go. Hooked up again, baby. Uh, hooked up again. Ah, uh, yeah. Right after the old backdrop. Running at us. Keep coming at me, baby. Keep coming at me. It ain't big. It ain't like the other flathead. If it is a flathead. It ain't moving like a turtle. Oh, we got us another, got us a channel. That's a channel in the weeds. Get out of the weeds, man. going home with meat too y'all he's got that piece of chicken deep we could probably get it out but told you today was a meat day all right guys little channel probably two or three pounds boy he chomped down on my thumb boy tried to go through his gills get the hook out he did not like it he's going home as meat Whew. Sorry guys, some of my bins. Whew. I am struggling y'all. I left my water in the truck. I've been baking in the sunshine for about four hours now, so maybe three and a half. I'm thirsty, I'm dehydrated, my hands are starting to cramp up. I had trouble getting up that hill. I mean, I made it, but I'm having to sit here and take a break. And I normally don't do that. Sorry, I'm open mouth breathing. Mouth is dry, dehydrated feeling. I'm trying to hold the camera out of the sun and in, in your face. I gotta go down there and either get the fish or let the fish go. They're on a stringer. I wanna take them home. I got about a half a mile walk, all uphill, to get back to my truck with all my gear and the weight of them fish in the net. I think I can do it. If I get down this hill and stay winded, take about a five more minute break, I'm gonna let them go. If I let them go, I'll show you letting them go down there. If I take them, you'll probably see me cleaning them at the house. So anyways, y'all, stay tuned while I figure something out. Get back. All right, guys, I'm telling you, I'm just struggling too bad. I wanna take these guys home, make a catfish stew out of them, but I'm having trouble, man. So I'm going to let them go. They're still alive. Grab him like that. All right, guys. These guys are going free. Sorry, I just can't make it. I got too far to go.
he swam off. And he power tailed off. All right, guys, both of them guys are fine. I'm shutting the camera off, taking this sucker off my chest, and I'm going home and drinking a lot of water and getting in the AC. All right, guys, about a quarter way back to the truck. Had to get in the shade. Give me like 10, 20 seconds to let my heart rate go down. Leaving that water in the truck was dumb. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Stay hydrated. Be out there in the sun. It's hot. Don't be like me. Stay hydrated. Phew. All right. Take me another 20, 30 seconds. I'm back at it. All right, guys. I dumped the gear back there. I'm walking to the truck. I can drive into the gear. Ain't no way I'd have made it with them fish. I couldn't even make it the rest of the way with the gear. I had two big of plans today. Some of them worked out, some of them didn't. <sighs> this was a tough one, y'all. Caught some decent fish. Made some mistakes along the way. All right. I got another 16th of a mile to go. I'll be at the truck. Oh, air conditioner and water. Air conditioner and water. Here I come, baby. Here I come. Oh, man. Gotta get out and load my stuff up, y'all. Then to the house. Appreciate y'all coming along with me. Once again, I will get back at you. When I get back at it, check you later. Bye.